Igbos who live in Lagos, open your eyes. Don't sleep with your two eyes. And when somebody push you, push back. You push you form, come together now. When they are shouting, Igbos must go. Plan how you defend yourself. Plan how you defend your property. Plan how you throw them inside lagoon. First of all, when he started, go straight to Oba, throw him inside the lagoon. Hello guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Well, welcome to this Facebook page and YouTube channel. Okay guys, welcome back again. I tell you how things they go, I'm out of the play for Nigeria. I dare to bring a on a doorstep, make you say things they unfold. Without wasting much of my time. Guys, I go and play on a video, not be smart, you know. Bola I met if you know, and Baba Jide Sanwo Olu, don't order the arrest of this Igbo man. This Igbo businessman. Say make the arrest this man for inciting violence in Lagos states. Say this man they call for fights. Say man they go catch the Oba of Lagos state. May they throw him for a side lagoon. Hey, guys, I go play on a video and see what this man said. And this is the same thing the Yoruba, some of the Yorubas, we are doing to the Igbos in Lagos states. Now, one of the Igbo prominent man has come outside telling the Igbos. The Igbos need to stand up and fight for their self. Enough of this intimidation. Enough of this attack. And the Igbos are not attacking back. Guys, I will give you guys a chance to watch this video. Hear what this man said. And it's not about three to four, five days ago. I saw a video. When they were demolishing an Igbo man apartment. Bro. What is going on in that legal state? Let me shock you guys. You see some of those buildings... That they are demolishing in Lagos State. Most of them belongs to the Igbos. Most of those buildings belongs to the Igbos. But I don't just know why Lagos State government keep on demolishing these people properties. Now, this Igbo prominent man has come outside to tell the Igbos enough is enough. Guys, take your time. Watch this video. After this man made this speech. Bola Ahmed Ifkinibu and you know Babajide Sanwo Olu and Bola Ahmed Ifkinibu they are five and six. Babajide Sanwo Olu and Bola Ahmed Ifkinibu order for his arrest. They need to arrest this man for inciting violence, inciting fight, threats in Lagos State. But when the Yorubas were attacking the Igbos, nobody came out to say, oh, what the Yorubas are doing to the Igbos is bad. Now, when the Igbos try to, you know, Say something. They are sending for his arrest. Watch this video and I will read what this Yoruba man said. Watch they will come back. Fight to the last, with the last blood. It's better you people rise, stop this year nonsense. Igbos who live in Lagos, open your eyes. Don't sleep with your two eyes. And when somebody push you, push back. You push you form, come together now. When they are shouting, the Igbos must go. Plan how you defend yourself. Plan how you defend your property. Plan how you throw them inside the lagoon. First of all, when he started, go straight to Oba, throw him inside the lagoon. Burn down Lagos. If they want to, if they will start this nonsense. Eh? What is wrong with you? See, see me see trouble. We came to Lagos to build Lagos. Lagos is, is, is full of water. Or the men go Luis or them. Hebrew. All of them. They come to build Lagos. After all, the Lagos belong to the first uh, power of Lagos is from Benin. Now you are coming to claim what you don't have. Why are you claiming what you don't have? You are claiming what you don't have, and you can't give what you don't have. Who said Lagos belongs to you? Enough is enough. Stop waking the lion, lion, sleeping lion. Stop calling our name. This man through all this nonsense he has sharing in social media. And the one your people, I'm calling the elders. Elders, rise up. You can't be elders and this is be moving around. Who is someone? Who is the same world? This is this is 
Can you in beside? Call himself Usangolu. Very wicked human being. Whatever you will do against Ibos, he will come back to you, hurt you. If he didn't hurt you, it will hurt your children, your generation. He said, he said, he said. Okay, guys. After this speech, Babajine Sanwolu and Bola Ahmed Tinubu got to order for his arrest. They need to arrest him immediately. Because they said, the man said, they need to start fighting in Lagos. They need to catch the upper of Lagos and throw him inside the uh -huh, la la go go. Yes. That's what this man said. Because the man saw what is going on in Lagos. The attack on the Igbos keep increasing every day. Even to the essence, Atik who got to tweet on this hashtag Igbo must leave Lagos. This thing has been going on for us for some time now. You see some of these prominent Yoruba people, none of them come outside to kick against it. But after this man, there was one that came out. It's not last year or last two years. If I know, no, last year, 2023 presidential election. This, this Igbo man came out in Lagos State when he said, the Yorubas are attacking us. If we call our people from Southeast, the ESN, that man only spoke. The next day of it, what happened? Baba Jine Sanwolu and Bola Ahmed Tiftinibu got to send DSS to arrest that man. Till this minute, we don't even know the whereabouts of that man as we speak. So the same thing now, Baba Jine Sanwolu and Bola Ahmed Tiftinibu said they must arrest this man for inciting violence, hate speech in Lagos State. But wait to. I understand we don't need division in Nigeria, but it real sense. We all just need to sit down and watch carefully what the Igbos has been going through in Lagos State. What these people has been going through in Lagos State. Some of them, their buildings, their properties have been demolished because of these wicked people call themselves leaders of the country see what happened about three to four five six days ago i don't know when but see what happened according to what we heard they said an evil man owns this apartment watch what happened here <laughs> According to what we heard, they said this apartment is owned by an Igbo man. If you tell me, why are they doing this? I will say, I sense jealousy inside here. I sense jealousy inside here. Because you cannot tell me you love someone and you are demolishing their property, everything that concerns them that they hold in Lagos states you are destroying it even to the extent they even tag them hashtag Igbo must leave Lagos this whole thing happened this few periods inside this protest when the protests were going on this whole thing happened Igbo must leave Lagos to the extent I think you got to come outside this man that tweeted this right up Never came out to tweet when the Yoruba said Igbos must leave Lagos. This man never tweeted. But after this man, this Igbo prominent man came out to speak that Igbo need to stand up and fight for themselves. Enough of this intimidation that this man came outside to write this. Let me read. Look at what he wrote. The man said, His name is Boyega Kosle. He said, Who is this Ibeshile again? 
This is one among several hateful, divisive, and bigoted person that come on this East app to cause tension, generate hate, and incite violence against the good people of Lagos and by extension, the Yorubas, who are generally known to be peaceful and tolerant. We call on all well million Nigerians to stand up against this kind of person and many of his type, while at the same time inviting the relevant law enforcement agency to speedily look into this act. We can't allow action of people like this to continue to cause division and ultimately ethnic-based crisis in our land. That's what this man wrote in his Twitter known as X. But when the Eurobars came out to write hashtag Igbo must go, this man never come out to write this. But when this man came out to say no, Igbo stand up, fight for your rights, then you now see the coming out. Oh, this hateful speech, you are inciting violence in Lagos State. See, I understand we have some, you know, good Yorubas people. Don't get me wrong. We have some good Yorubas people. But you see people like this man that just tweeted this right up now. These are the wicked Yorubas we are talking about. When Yorubas, some of them were attacking the Igbos. None of them put up a write-up like this to tell the Yorubas to stop attacking the Igbos. None of them came out to put up a write-up. But whenever the Igbos come outside, because you know the Igbos, they hardly talk. They don't talk. But when they say something, bro, you will see the presidents, Babajide Sanwolu, all of them, will, they will be running around. Now, this man got to come outside and drop these tweets. We don't need problem in Nigeria. Yes, no doubt. But at least, you guys just need to respect these people. Respect their business. Respect everything about the Eagles, for Christ's sake. You guys will demolish their property. Do everything to, you know, fight these people. And you think that people will not come outside and speak. They will come outside and talk one day. And this is the day. And Bola Ahmed Tifchinibu and Babajide Sanwo Olu, they are calling for his arrest. They want to arrest him. Like, have you arrest those people who said, hashtag Igbo must leave Lagos? How many of them have you guys arrested? How many? The last time we heard, they said, uh, they are investigating them. Uh, you know, you are investigating people that you know. You are still investigating them. Hmm, Nigeria. See, it is better we all start doing things together or we divide the country. Simple. Since you guys don't want the Igbo to stay in Lagos, you don't want them to participate in anything in the country, then let them have their Biafra and let it go. Simple. I come in peace, don't come for me. Because me, I see the truth. I see the truth. The Igbos, what this man said, Igbo need to just stand up. According to the comment, I went to the comment section. I read, somebody say, Mokuna just carried the Oba of Lagos. Mokuna to for Laguna. I be the bad person of Lagos. I know that before. Oba of Lagos. That man is literally wicked. That's how we end this video. I copy paste. Please help me to share this video. I beg you. Share this video. Give this video thumbs up. Allow YouTube to help us to recommend this video out. The more thumbs up you give, the more YouTube help us to recommend the video out. As you do so, God bless you. See you guys on my next video. Stay safe, guys, and bye bye.